Hello, it is a sunny day. We would like to go outside. It is quite sunny. It's quite sunny. And we'd like to go outside now. Would you please let us out? We've been in here for quite a while because you were too stupid not to be able to run yet. You were too busy. Too busy training alpacas to use a halter. Come on, let us out. Let us out right now. We will call the chicken union. We will tell them that you have kept us in unworkable conditions. You must let us out. All right, we're here today and we're going to be clipping our chicken's wings so they can go out into our yard and uh, and not fly away on us. It's a beautiful sunny day. Let's get started. So what we've got today is a pair of, ah, could he go on? Shoot, no. We've got a pair of really sharp scissors and we're only gonna clip one wing. So we wanna make sure that Jess is gonna hold on to her real tight and we'll look at one wing at a time and make sure she doesn't already have one clipped. Here, and I'm just going to cut them right down the middle so they're easy to see. Aside from being a little scary, this shouldn't hurt them. And we do try to get our, our dogs acclimated to all the livestock so they know better than to kill them. So you'll see them around. And this always. is the first encounter they've had with the chickens outside of the pen. They've been really good with the chickens in the pen, so we'll see. We saw a cookie licking her chops, but that just may be her being excited and wanting to play with She's it. She's also trying to eat the chicken food, unfortunately. Yeah. So, see there we have one cut, and then we'll show you in contrast, that's one that's not cut. Okay. So let him off. Yep, we're going to let her go. Okay, we're going to let her go, and there's all these there, dogs around, so we're going to be really careful. There's, set her down there's by the, the food. Feed. The dogs are kind of checking them out, but I think they're going to be okay. No, don't eat the feet. They want to eat the feed and not the chicken. <laughs> it's a little bit confusing. Okay. Good boy for Well, that's a pretty good sign that they want to eat the feed and not the chicken. Okay, moving on. Here she goes. Unhand to me. She's, a... uh, She's got very sharp claws. That's this is sure. big Nancy. Okay, here we go. Check both wings. Nope. Mark it. And no. Nope. So we're going to go ahead and do this one. You can see. Right across. Okay. Very, very sharp scissors. And there we are. Okay, we'll put her down. a year could be less could younger be ones they uh they molt and regrow their wing feathers a lot faster than the mature ones so depending on how old these are <laughs> oh, she's strong she, she's very strong okay or could you be good here we go this one i remember thinking that she did marco go she just has short ones okay here we go In a circle. The so most they could okay. do is get into a tree. Okay. And in Spain, you'll see people in their apartments. They have chickens just outside there in their backyard. It's pretty insane. Among among the dogs, it's crazy enough. But okay. the dogs just know better. 
which is usually you just have to give the dog a spanking if they do anything bad. Uh, and, and the chickens are pretty good at fending for themselves. Our orange dog has been uh, pecked in the face <coughs> numerous times. <coughs> yeah, the Spanish man <coughs> said, to, he's like, oh no, the chicken's going after, the dog's going after your chickens. Oh, the chickens went after the dog. <coughs> they're about the same size anyway. <coughs> oh, shut up, Marco. <coughs> oh, there you have it. And there you go. That's how you uh, clip the chicken wings, and then they shouldn't fly off, and they can go outside for a little bit. We just have to keep an eye on them around our dogs. Yeah. But our dogs are pretty well trained and not go after livestock, so. There you have it. And they found the watering hole. Put the puppy in line. They're putting the puppy in line. Ultimately, we need a rooster. That would be good protection for them. The cats are seeing if they'd make a good lunch, but they haven't been able to be able to mess with them too much because they've got terrible claws on them. But uh, we're going to keep a close eye on them. We want them to be free range, but the animals got to know that they can't mess with them. And that, that's the point of the rooster. See you guys.